Today, Orange County Sheriff Jerry Demings will pitch a crime-fighting plan to county leaders. Over the past month, deputies have focused on Pine Hills after a record number of violent incidents. West Jews' Alex Villarreal is live in downtown Orlando. Alex, can you tell us a little bit about this presentation later on today? Michelle, this presentation by Sheriff Demings is purely informational. He is not actually asking the board to do anything, but he will be presenting law enforcement strategies for tackling violent crime in Pine Hills, which has been on the rise. And take a look at this. This mobile station, mobile substation that's now set up in Pine Hills is one of those strategies. It is part of a program the Sheriff's Office and Orlando Police launched last month to fight that rising violence in Pine Hills and also ease rising fear. And the program is called Operation Rise. It stands for Restoration, Inclusiveness, Safety, and Environment. Officers have ramped up patrols in Pine Hills and say that they arrested over 180 people in the operation's first month. Now, also on the table today is the sheriff's request for a new over $300,000 armored vehicle. Sheriff Demings applied last month to use U.S. Justice Department funds to pay for it, and he says that the SWAT team needs this vehicle for active shooter and terrorist situations like the massacre at Pulse nightclub that took 49 lives. The sheriff's office already has one armored vehicle, but Demings said that the ability to respond to multiple locations with armored assets is more imperative than ever. And we can't expect that that will pass very easily today. It is on the consent agenda and usually the items on the consent agenda are approved quickly. It's something that we will watch for you today along with Sheriff Deming's presentation on crime fighting in Pine Hills. Live in Orange County, Alex Villarreal, West 2 News.